hello my sweeties i hope that you're good to those who are coming for the first time my sweetie you are most welcome please hit that subscribe button please join our fam and to those who are coming back hey fam hey fam hey fam my day ones my sweeties i hope that you're good guys today's video is going to be informative and i'm not making this video because i think that my youtube is grown enough or i've i've made it i'm nowhere close to where i want to be and i still need to learn a lot more and whatever but i felt i feel like i should do it because it will be more relatable for somebody who's gonna start a youtube channel for me personally when i started a youtube channel i felt like it was too challenging because i was trying to search on how to start a channel how what how what how to do this how to do that and these big youtubers explained like in a way as if like i'm always like I'm, I'm i'm halfway there like i know half of the things and they're just adding on to but i was confused most of the time every time they somebody explains something i would have to go back again and go google it you understand so i felt like i'm gonna simply i want to make this video so that i can simplify it um and it's more understandable and everything like that for those who want to join us and start a channel a quick disclaimer guys i am not naked in this video i know that it may look like it i was wearing a, a boob tube top when i started filming i noticed mid filming that it actually looks like i'm not wearing any top at all because the top doesn't appear at all it, like so it seems like i'm hiding my breasts but i'm actually naked i am not um so i just wanted to, to put it out there so that you don't feel comfortable in any way i hope that you'll understand yeah let's say how to how to start a youtube channel you know like yeah let, let's 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 do that you know um okay so obviously the the basics you must have a google account and you must um register that google account too and everything like that so that you your youtube is active it's yours now it's personal also make sure um make sure that your profile picture it's something that you know that it's not going to bother you anytime soon. You understand? Because you're still building your brand. You don't want to be changing profile pictures every now and then or whatever. So make sure you choose one that you know. Okay, maybe I'm going to keep this for, I don't know, for, for until my my YouTube is where I want it to be or almost there. You understand? And it, ta it takes different times for everyone. Some people, it takes little time. For some people, it takes longer. So... Put a profile picture where you show that, you know what, I am okay with this profile picture, even if I'm going to have it for the next five years without changing it, I'm okay. So um, make sure that you have that and your YouTube name as well. Your YouTube name as well because you're still new, you're still trying or whatever. We don't want to set you and you are, uh, what, Ntabi saying, and then next thing you've changed, you are tabby something something underscore something you understand like just consistency for the for for some time because you're still building you still want to be figured out you still you know you're still gaining um subbies and everything like that keep to one name keep to one profile picture so when you choose that be careful make sure it's something that you're definitely going to be comfortable with to have chances are for years you understand for for a couple of years um so there's that and then now once you've done that once you've had you have your your channel ne, i suggest that you upload it or you, like, you post on your instagram your whatsapp share with friends ask your friends to share with friends and share on their socials as well for people to start following your channel and have a due date on of like okay my very first video is going to be uploaded on the 12th of whatever time and then so in the meantime can you guys follow me can you guys follow me you understand i mean can you guys subscribe to my channel so at least that when you post your very first video you have something you know you you have something you don't just upload a video and you didn't even notify anybody nobody knows you or whatever you understand so is why is that maybe after you have created your channel after you have um you have your profile picture you have everything done now share it with people share your 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 youtube with everybody uh, like to subscribe and everything like that once that is done you you now focus on what is going to be your niche right 
now i struggle a lot to understand what a niche is and everything because youtubers when they explain when i started a channel people are like um you must know what your niche is and that's it they just they just say that and pass and i'm like what is a niche like what is that i must know what my niche is but i don't even know what a niche is so basically a niche is basically like your focus your focus points like what is your youtube gonna be based on yeah you know, there's travel there's travel channels there's like your hair and beauty channels there's like your games and whatever channels vlogs whatever right there's people who focus on story times only some people do business only you know that's a niche that is a niche so you must now come and say okay i want to create my own niche and i advise that your niche it must be something that you're really interested in so that you can keep up with it you understand so that it doesn't feel like youtube should be fun for you the creator you understand so that the rest of everybody when they receive it they enjoy it because you enjoy it as well you enjoy doing it you understand when you enjoy doing something definitely you're gonna do it proper so make sure that your niche is something that you definitely prefer right and also when you when you when you choose your niche right broaden it a bit because you have not grown yet so broaden it so that you have a lot of content you understand that's what i did i have story time i have vlogs i have this i have hair i have beauty i have that everything is it's broad for now you understand and then now once maybe my channel is where i want it to be i'll narrow it down and say okay my channel actually focuses on this and this and this alone you understand so broaden it so that you don't have to struggle so that you can be able to be consistent when you say um your channel is based on travel vlogs only you understand and you travel like three times a year or five times a year you understand that your channel is not gonna grow because you're gonna post this month in february and then you're gonna go post again in may when you travel again in may and go post again in september when you travel again in september so make sure that you broaden your niche have have your travels have your story time have your whatever it is that you're interested in me so that um you 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 don't run out of content because you're still new and you you want to be figured out so you want to be consistent you want to upload every now and then so do that broaden your niche and then you will narrow it down once you've you you've reached where you want to be or even if you have not reached where you want to be um sometimes you broaden your niche and then based on the responses that you get from people uh on your videos then you know how like okay on my church on my channel i'm sorry on my channel people enjoy mostly my story times so now you know how to how to how to narrow your your niche now you know goti okay people like my story times so definitely story times has to be um remaining part of my niches and just like that you understand yes um consistency guys consi okay once now you've narrowed you've you've um figured out your niche and everything like that okay before i talk about the consistency let me talk about this now that you've done that now you must start filming right you must start filming your videos ne? i know that a lot of people feel discouraged to start a channel because they don't have a camera or whatever you don't have like your fancy tripods and those big lights and everything like that you don't need none of those to start a channel you just need a good phone with good quality it doesn't matter if it's a samsung a huawei an iphone or whatever as long as the quality is is good enough that's okay i still don't have a camera to this day i still film my videos on my phone you understand make sure that you have a proper phone with 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 a good quality camera make sure that you have a tripod or a ring light whatever stand you prefer that you're gonna use to film your videos right now personally i don't even have um a ring light or a tripod with with like the the long adjustable um legs because it broke so where my, my where my phone is positioned right now it could fall at any point so get yourself that so that you don't have to struggle because sometimes lately i want to film and i'm like oh, i don't have this i don't have that i have to put things on top of things on top of things for for the right length and it, it's just a lot for me to start filming because i don't have that so make sure that you get you that ring lights and tripods are very cheap on take a lot they're very affordable so just get yourself that you understand 
um what else okay editing editing as well i know a lot of people struggle with that editing personally i use one app to edit but it's not advisable because it limits me a lot so i'm i i still need to do research on like the other apps that i may use it's just that somebody just suggested it to me and it was very like easy for me to understand and everything and to use so for beginners i advise that you use this app the app is vn like just vn and for me it's convenient it's quite easy to use it's quite easy to understand like nobody had to explain or show me how to use it like i just automatically knew how to maneuver around it and everything like that because it is that simple so for beginners i advise that you use that and um i i see a lot of people who have iphones use imovie it, it, it's, a, it's an app already on your phone so you can use that too for me imovie was not convenient so i never use it at all um so vn I, I i definitely love it um but I, i'll do another video once i've 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 started using other editing apps so that, so that my videos can even be more interesting you understand so that you know i'm more creative and everything like that once i i once i i know my way into other apps and everything i will definitely let you guys know you understand i'm so sorry about the background noises guys uh you know what i'm babysitting and oh, it's a lot okay and then another app that i use it's canva canvas canva oh my canva <laughs> it's canva canva it's an app you use for your thumbnails and stuff okay now slowing it down what is a thumbnail you see your videos like when you open someone's youtube and you press you go on videos ne? why didn't i bring my other phone because i feel like it's gonna explain wait let me fetch my phone thumbnails are very important please do make thumbnails for your videos because it's the first thing a person is going to see when they open your channel and they go to videos they must see thumbnails so that they're interested make them interesting so that the person is like mm, okay i want to watch that video is the thumbnail that's gonna make people more interested in seeing what they're gonna watch it also helps with when you excuse me when you basically put your videos on other socials when you put your link the links to your videos on other socials and everything like that you have a thumbnail so somebody is looking at your story and looking at the thumbnail and it's like okay i'm visiting this channel because this looks like it's going to be an interesting video so thumbnails are made for that don't ever have a video without a thumbnail unless i guess if you are huge it's like at some point and you don't really really need follow like subscribers anymore or you you understand then maybe it's okay but for now because you're still new you want to interest people you want people to come in multiples and everything like that and keep on coming back thumbnails are very important to do that for you so it's canva and it's vn um now now you start uploading your videos you have all that you have your phone you have your apps and everything like that you filmed your videos you start to upload now one other important thing consistency consistency you are new in the game so chances of you your your very first video to get like 50 views they're very high you understand and it might be 50 views from the subscribers that you gained before you even uploaded you understand personally i got like 50 sub 56 subscribers before i uploaded my very first video and my very first video i got about like um 100 views was it yeah 100 views you understand so some people they're like oh i this thing is not gonna grow what not they complain now you must be consistent in order for you to get more subscribers to get more views to get more likes you must be very very consistent right now i don't want to lie i haven't been consistent and i like I, I i made a promise to myself that from monday i'm gonna be very consistent 
oh my gosh guys i am so sorry my phone space started acting up and i couldn't finish filming the video filming the video this is a couple of days later and i'm using someone else's phone i understand so yeah i was talking about consistency before the video cut right and i was about to tell you guys about how consistency worked out for me personally my plan my goal was that my channel should reach at least 500 subscribers by the time by by the time it's a year old and i am on one point something 1.4 i think close to 1.5 and it's not even a year yet um, my channel is going to turn a year next month and i feel like what worked out for me was consistency more than anything is it recording yeah more than anything because i used to upload at least twice a week or so you understand so i feel like so i advise you guys to be consistent upload consistently twice or more a week you understand and by the time you are monetized it works at your advantage because when you don't upload more your views go down your watch time hours go down and when those go down your money also goes down i've been monetized since october and i haven't made any coin from from youtube because i haven't been consistent so i'm gonna start being very consistent because i really should be getting money out of this because this is a lot of work um talking to you guys and editing and all that it really is um a lot of work and i feel like i should really start working a lot hard so that i can earn and make um money out of this you understand and one last thing i wanted to talk about was engagement guys it is important to be present be there enjoy yourself and everything when you when you record when you film a video don't don't be bored don't don't be irritated and all that you understand but like be there like be you know like people must feel you and by that i don't mean that you should have a vibrant personality or whatever because there's a lot of people who don't have that there's one lady i love to watch oh my gosh what's her name what's her channel i forgot and she's so soft spoken and whatever but you know what you feel her she's there you understand she's enjoying what she's doing therefore you enjoy her you enjoy her softness as well you understand so yeah so yeah and with all this guys you can go on ahead and start your channel and you'll do very much well i hope that you enjoyed this video i'll see you guys on the next one and i love you my sweetest bye